a fire safety assembly at school. Mm. Sure, anything to be able to Sure. Class. I love assemblies. Some of the best naps of my life. Wow, thanks. I did not see that coming. You being, you know, interested in complicated issues, helping out with the public. Do you want me to change my mind? I... No. <laughs> How seriously am I taking this right now? Smokeweed the bear. Evans and ass clown. Fine, I'll do it myself. There you go. Just don't expect this to become a habit. Blackwell Academy, home of tomorrow's leaders. Principal Dix, big. <laughs> ah, no one really signed his thing. That's awful. Big McHuge balls. <laughs> oh my God. What? Caring about important issues? Do you not Caring see who signed your thing? I'm the only person that legit signed it, dude. Whoa. All right, is he gonna want me to go over there? Chloe. Yep. Class is back the other way. I don't want to go to class. I'm gonna get my DVD. Hi, friends. Steph and Mikey. Hello. Steph Gingrich and Mikey North, Blackwell's premier indoor kids. Steph has created something of a business selling pirated DVDs to other students. If I had known the Celestial Avenger was bloodied, I would have totally given him my potion. It was a skill challenge. Potion wouldn't have worked. Skill challenge? It's part of the tabletop game we play. You wouldn't understand. Try me. Give me a break, nerds. I've heard of tabletop games. Cool. Got my DVD? One Blade Runner. Director's cut coming right up. Sweet. Five bucks, right? Keep it. I'm just glad someone here appreciates the classics. You even asked for the director's cut, which took out the shitty voiceover and replaced it with a sweet dream sequence. Dream life over real life. That's my motto. Right on. Are you alright, buddy? Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? Rachel. Man, everyone Amber. loves her, huh? You're asking me? Didn't you two go out last night, or was it just like a friend thing? Mm, both of those sound kind of douchey. What's it to you? Why do you want to know? <laughs> Steph has a crush. Chloe. You should join her. <laughs> the eyes you just gave yeah. him. That was awesome. I don't have 50 hours right now. Thanks, though. We're at the end of the campaign, so it'll only take like 20 minutes. What else have you got to do before class? Hell yeah, let's play some games. Hell yeah, let's play some games. What the hell? Game on, nerds. Here's a character sheet. You are an elf barbarian. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Well, considering my reaction, I'm going to have to go with I'm totally an elf bar bar barbarian, but I want to know. But he'll probably nerd out and be like, those are worse stats because they use strength and not dexterity. That's me nerding out. Nice. I could totally see myself as an elf barbarian. I know. I'm good. All right. Let's get started. You are hey, both famous heroes in the foot. kingdom of Avernon, a once peaceful land now laid Stop to waste by the bloodthirsty raiders of owies. Black Well. Alone, you have fought your way through the raider camps, seeking their warlord leader, Durgaron, the Unscarred. As you enter the final camp, bloodied and weary, you see your fellow hero approaching from the opposite direction. I raise my staff to you in greeting. I am Elamoth, wizard of the Third Circle, foremost advisor to King Tiberius, and sworn defender of Avernon. Introduce your character. Y yeah, okay. Uh, I'm an elf barbarian named... Uh... Barb. Calamastasia. Calamastia. Or that. Super into it. Not bad. The two heroes... Hold on. 
Elamon narrows his eyes at the elf in front of him and says, I am here to defeat Durgaron, the Unscarred. In the name of King Tiberius, what makes you think you are worthy to fight alongside me? According to my character sheet. I once made a man kebab. I once stabbed a guy in the chest with a sword, and it went all the way through and killed the guy behind him too. True story. Ha! <laughs> you stand this part is at awesome. Midway crossing. To your left, the raiders' training ground. To your right, their prison camp. Straight ahead, an enormous, ostentatious tent that could only belong to Durgaron, the Unscarred. Which way do you go? Straight ahead, right? We're supposed to kill the Dur dude. Elamon frowns. The raiders could have some good loot at the training ground, and surely it is our duty to free all those prisoners. Your choice, newbie. Hell yeah, Where I was gonna say, to go? we gotta go, um, to the prison camp. Guess it's time to free some peeps. Let's go to the prison camp. You behold a field of standing iron cages, each imprisoning a human villager, calling out for you to free them. Only a small, elderly dragonkin is keeping watch. He notices you, and in terror, runs into one of the few empty cages and locks himself in. Ah, uh, poor little guy. What's a dragonkin? Dragonkin are like little dragon people. They're assholes. I bet he has all the keys. Oh, okay. Hey, shitface! Get out of there! The dragonkin hops up and down, shaking his ring of keys at you. He shouts in a strange language. Whatever he's saying, probably isn't flattering. Got any useful spells in that robe of yours? Nothing that wouldn't blow up the cage and everything in it. Hell yeah, Intimidate. Hmm. Hmm. I'm an elf. I may have decent charisma. Intimidate, let's go! Intimidate. Barbarian. That's a skill I have. Hell Can yeah. I do that? I want the little bastard to shit his pants. <laughs> Hell yeah, Chloe. What do you say? This is Listen so good. Up, you little lizard. Unfortunately, he doesn't speak common, which means he can't I cast communication on the dragon kid. Hell yeah. Shit. Really? Now, thanks, you can understand dude. every word you say. I love Time this game. Some real magic. So this, this is, awesome. is called a skill challenge where you try to use. Oh, I know what this is. I grab the bars of the cage and lean in, nice and close. He steps back, his scaly skin quivering in fear. What do you say? Dragons are pussies. Meat puppet. Shoes. Meat puppet. I wiggle my hand. Hey, dragonkin guy. Want to become my meat puppet? How it works is I shove my arm up your ass into your <sighs> head and then I can control your mouth from the inside to say things. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna scar these he kids. He doesn't seem to like that idea. Neither do I. The dragon can please with you. Please don't harm me, tall one. But I cannot give you key. Durgaron, much taller and meaner than you. Could make you shorter, could make you taller, die of old age, this could make you shorter. shit is hard. Try playing solo. The dragonkin swallows the key. No! It, I pushed left! And then his own butt, laughing at you. Then he- I shove my axe through the cage, right into his stomach. Then I twist it, and then pull it out. His guts and shit start falling everywhere, but I jam my hands inside his open stomach, grabbing the key. <laughs> then, I'm scarring these the people. in the final moments before he dies, I hold the key up to his face, and then I laugh. They're not gonna want to play with me again. Normally, I'd say you failed the challenge, except that was so horrifically amazing. Hell yeah! You won. Yeah! Go team! Why don't you start unlocking the prisoners? I'm on it. As you free them, the prisoners run away from you in fear. What's next? Training ground! Loot sounds good. Let's go to the training ground. It's that little lightning thing Upon that keeps happening in the background. The I don't know if you guys see it. You are spotted by a heavy set orc who immediately oh shouts and points. There are a dozen raiders on the training field, all of whom raise their weapons and charge. Okay. This isn't good. So what do we do? I cast 
Urgle's acid blast. Um, overkill? Bam! You conjure up a wave of acid that washes over the charging orcs. Every raider suddenly starts screaming and writhing in pain. There's a sweet and sour kind of smell as the flesh melts off their bones like warm candle wax. Holy She's a good shit. DM. You see why I haven't really needed a partner? The heavy set orc sergeant still remains. He runs at you swinging a massive warhammer. All yours. All yours. Fatal cleave, knee slam, pommel strike. Pommel strike. I do a pommel strike. I strike his pommel hard. <laughs> um, what did I say? A pommel is the end of a sword handle. Pommel strike is where you hit the guy with it. Ah, damn it. Okay, I do that. Except you're not wielding a sword, you're wielding an axe. Damn it. It sucks. It's all right. Try using your. You've delayed too long. The orc swings his warhammer at no. your head, barely missing your move. Fatal cleave. Okay, let's end this. Fatal cleave. You swing your great axe downward with both hands. The orc blinks, then splits open like a hot dog bun. <laughs> Fuck yeah! I'm awesome at this game. I'm awesome at this it's game. I love low. Chloe. What about the loot? Well, as the training ground is now a roiling pit of acid, it's unlikely any loot survived. Dang. Aww. We all make mistakes. Don't worry, Alamon guy. We all make mistakes. Alamon, nods. Calamastia, the elf barbarian, is most wise and forgiving. Hey, What's Sabrina. Up? What's up? Mm, Warlord it's sent. Tent time. Loots. Enter the tent to find Durgaron, Warlord. Oh my God, he's a freaking well. minotaur. I Sitting love him. comfortably at his throne. I want to be his friend. He's a huge red-eyed minotaur. Swathed in a fine black cloak, gripping a two-handed sword that's easily six feet long. His laughter bellows. Wah, ha, 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 ha. Your lands and people are already mine. Your deeds here mean nothing. Your kingdom was weak. That's a sick model. You I'd want weak. that. What an asshole. I got this. I cast Zael's cataclysmic cone of fire. The fire fizzles out on contact. Durgaron laughs again, holding up his right arm to show off his bracer of fire immunity. Shit. All of my yeah, I was just gonna say that. fire based. Except for, you know, acid blast, which someone used unnecessarily to show off for Chloe. Snap. Alastia? What'll it be? Snap. Uh annihilation strike. Wrathful rush, brutal punch. Annihilation strike! Oh, holy shit! Uh, annihilation strike! This sounds, that sounds boss as fuck! I love this! One? No shit! That's bad, right? Critical miss. Not for me. As you take your first step, no. you trip on a rock, collapsing onto the ground in a clangy jumble of metal. Your axe swings wildly to the side. Mikey? No! Reflex save. I'm gonna kill my friend! Oh no. Three. Your axe strikes Elamon's leg. Um, legs, plural. Severing both feet no! at the This game is awesome! <laughs> I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. Durgaron moves toward the crippled Elmon. Oh, shit. I told you this was my best boss. You didn't tell me my character might die. Durgaron approaches, stomping his bloody hooves. Stomp, stomp, stomp. This is all my fault. Sort of. What should I do? I'm dense. Jump in front of Elamon. Jump in front. I jump in front of Elamon. So much wow. inception going on. Thanks. <laughs> I mean, thanks, Calamastia. Okay. Durgaron has now turned his attention toward you. Bring it. He charges, thrusting madly with his great sword. Critical, come on. Shit. Oh, no. Don't be a one again. Your attempt to dodge his thrust fails. No. Durgaron laughs as he impales you on his blade, lifting you We're high into the air. Seriously? I can't do anything with that stupid bracer. I'm sorry, Chloe. Take off hey. the bracer. I chopped your feet off. 
I <laughs> chopped your feet off. Your strength draining away as Durgaron lifts you higher into the air. Super safe back to school. Five weeks left of classes. Oh, nice, do? Sabrina. How was your first day back? Swing for his arm. I bring my axe down onto his arm. The one with the fire bracer thingy. Oh, brilliant. You'll have to roll high to hit. You're almost dead. Crit. 20. Nailed it. Yes. You bring your axe down and awake. Yeah. Severing his arm completely. Cook him. Cook his him alive. Let's make some sticks. To the ground. I cast Gignomi's fire strike of flame. Oh, snap. Lying on the ground, you conjure a flaming spear, which flies from your hand. I'm not going to be able to get out of here with no legs and a chest, incinerating him. Impalement. From the inside out. Damn, Elamon. Durgron is defeated, but your wounds were too great. I'm afraid Calamastia is dead. I actually feel sad right now. Better to have died a hero than live as a coward. That was you have fun. no feet. Check out what I drew. Mikey's got serious drawing skills. Fuck yeah, man. Oh, that was so cool. Oh, man. Guys, like, seriously, super nerding out. I love it. That was so much fun. Oh, I wonder if you could actually survive it, like, and not get jacked up. That's so cool. Glad you enjoyed it. Chloe. Gaming inside your game. Yeah. I'll adventure with you anytime. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Bragger, you had it right, buddy. Thanks for the game, nerds. That was awesome. I want to play more. DVD. I got my DVD. Check. Next stop, chemistry class. All right. Enjoy. Now we got to actually go to school. Ah, oh, that was so much fun, guys. <laughs> you like these guys, Sabrina? Is that Nathan Prescott? I'm gonna hell? punch him in the face. Nope, what it's not. Got here? Twitch. Don't Twitch. I'm streaming to that. True North. A jock so dumb he makes jocks look bad. Guess Nathan Prescott made the shit list. That is Nathan Prescott. Oh, you wow. can get wrecked. This is some really weird crap, Prescott. It's not yours. Give it back. I hate that you're on the team now. You're such a loser. You're both losers. Yeah, you're both Guys, losers. I don't care. No need to fight. You can both be losers. The mute speaks. Whoa, whoa. You earn a spot on the squad, Twitch. You don't have your dad try to buy off the coach. At least my family pays tuition. How much financial aid does your deadbeat dad need again? Fuck you, dude. Wow. Dick move, Nathan. My dad lost his job at the shipyard when your dad closed it down. And you want to talk shit to me? Leave Nathan alone. You know something, Prescott? I'm going to do you a favor. You can't be a part of the team and be into this stupid crap at the same time. Uh-oh. You're a piece of shit. I am going stop to it. kill you. You guys, stop. Chloe, do something. Don't just stand there watching. I really hate Nathan. I'll step in. The only way to stop a bully is to be aggressive. I've got to put Drew down. Because I did just Back save Elamon in my role-playing game. What the hell did you just say to me? I'll get another black eye, apparently. I hate you, Nathan. I said idiot. Idiot? You're not used to a word that big, are you? Don't be scared. You're seriously defending Nathan Prescott? No. Nathan's an easy target. How about picking on someone your own size? Which I hear is pretty small. Damn! You're such a crazy freak. Mind your own business. You know what's crazy? What's crazy is that you haven't been held back yet. How is that possible? You want a piece of this? Piece of your bromance, a piece of cake? Piece of cake. Please. Kicking your ass is going to be a piece of He's cake. He's going to punch me. 
Wait, I did a thing. Did you just laugh? I did. Chloe just owned you. Shut the fuck up, fresh meat. Ooh.